Hi, welcome to day seven of the Earth Journey Adventure to Santa Fe. Um, and I'm actually, as a dyer, kind of excited about um, this color. Um, and I'll explain why in a minute. Um, but if you didn't already open it, get ready to open uh, because day seven is Ski Santa Fe. Did you know that um, Santa Fe is like really a ski town? It's not like you think of Phoenix where it's like more deserty and stuff. It's really a mountain town. And 30 minutes away is the Ski Santa Fe Resort. Um, and um, the color, the Ski Santa Fe color, if you didn't, is this, okay? Now, it's hard to see exact colors on your monitor and my com camera, computer, um, yeah, computer camera and everything. But the, you would think this is undyed, but it's not. Now the color, uh, this is undyed. Okay, that is, and it's kind of like that creamy ivory kind of color. Um, and that is not the color of snow. <laughs> so I'm going to hold them together and maybe you'll see the difference. Yeah, like this is not really the color of snow. So uh, as a dyer, I was just like, this was a challenge to me to try and get something very light, but also really kind of the color of snow with the sh shadows on it a little bit. Um, I mean, I certainly didn't want a yellow snow, although this is not really yellow, it's more ivory, but um, I, I, you know, I was actually very happy with that. And I, so, and I, I had to include this is because many people don't realize that Santa Fe is really kind of like a ski town, a ski town with lots of turquoise and you know, American stuff and, you know, just like, um, and beautiful Southwest stuff everywhere. But here, I, I didn't show you my knitting yesterday and I've only just started into this color, but this is what I've done so far. So you just have a couple rows of the snow, but here we go. And there's the mountains, there's the mountains. Um, and I'm only, remember I'm only doing half of each color. I'm doing uh, the, you see there's the silver that I just did yesterday. Um, I'm only doing half of each color right now. And then I'll finish the other half up in the other, image, on the other side of the project. Um, and I wanted to show you my screen because this is something I can show you that's open. Ski Santa Fe just opened for their 2020, 2021 season with COVID procedures, of course, like probably limitations of the number of people and masks and stuff. Um, they just opened a few days ago. I'm recording this on the 11th, but um, they opened a few days ago and I can show you with some webcams. So let's bring up my screen. There we go, there are some webcams. And I think like if you're actually watching, I might be able to control it. Now there's no sound or anything, but look, that's like real snow. I don't think that's like, that's not snow machines. They might be adding to oh, snow machines, I don't know. But look, that is half an hour from Santa Fe in early mid December. So there you go, you can go to Santa Fe, enjoy all the fabulous stuff. And right now, if you went there right now, um, you could go ski. Look, there's people on there. There's people skiing. I see them. They're all skiing. They're hiding the lifts and everything. So you could go right now and enjoy it. I think there's a 14 day quarantine if you come from, from out of state, but <laughs> but you could go and you could ski on the mountain. Um, yeah, I can control, try to control the camera. Ooh, there's a snowboarder. 30 seconds left. Oh, you like pick a view or something? Bambi. Oh, like you can go and try and. Oh, yeah, it turns the camera. See, I'm controlling the bottom one. It turns the camera so you can see different parts of it. So it's just, you can see how good the snow is if you're considering going there. <coughs> Jeez. Um, okay, so, and also they have like a. Uh, Go. There's their Instagram. Some really pretty pictures. Now you see that snow right there? You see? I don't know how well you can see it on your screens, but it is not an ivory color. Uh, you know, it depends on the snow, you know, the sunlight hitting it because it's reflecting that. But you see it's, it's, it's like a white and then the shadows end up kind of being 
kind of being a gray, but not, um, it's not a neutral gray. It's almost like one of those lavender kind of gray. So I was excited to actually achieve this color. I really liked it and I hope you do too. Um, um, so you can see, stop sharing my screen. You can investigate the Ski Santa Fe website as much as you like and see if you're ever considering going skiing there. I, myself, am a crappy skier. <laughs> I've only been skiing a few times and the first time I went skiing, I lived in Illinois where they like basically pile dirt on top of the hill to make like a bunny hill. There was actually something there. I remember when I was a teenager and that's the extent of my ski skills. So I would be very bad. I can toss myself down the mountain and fall a lot, but don't put me on one of those like difficult routes. Bunny slope all the way. <laughs> But I hope you're enjoying um, our, our little adventure. We've gone into the um, we've and gone into the ski Santa Fe, and now um, let's see what's next. Ah, oh, about tomorrow. I was excited to find this for tomorrow. I was excited to find what I want to show you. It was really, really interesting to me. So uh, you'll see the per color progression start to change now. Um, and I hope you're enjoying this. Um, and uh, this is about a week after Christmas, if you're following our timeline. So this is around New Year's. This is, I'd have to do the math. I don't this New Year's Eve or New Year's Day. Anyway, I'm probably going to be casting on a special project on New Year's Day. Be fun. I hope you guys are having a really good holiday and uh, I'll check in with you tomorrow. Bye.